Good morning, Mark. Good morning. So, all of the drama surrounding this guy, yeah. what do you think? Will AB fit with Brady and Belichick? I saw something on Twitter. I can't, I don't even know who it was, yeah. but I've got to give Twitter credit because they said he's a perfect fit. I mean, he illegally taped his coach. So, um, <laughs> I, I mean, that's a match yeah. made in heaven right there. <laughs> I, uh, you know, joking aside, here's the deal. Like, one thing about Bill Belichick and the New England Patriots and what makes them so good, and they are exceptional, is versatility. Their system is we don't have a system. Their system is we're going to do whatever it takes to win, and we're going to target your deficiencies. We're not going to sit there and, and lean a, upon our strengths necessarily. We're targeting your deficiencies. So think about this. A tight end-centric offense where the big plays were all through Gronkowski and they've been a two tight end system for a long time. Last night, their tight ends, two targets, one catch, three yards. And they go to the wide receivers. They're like, okay, this is where we're at. Mm -hmm. This is who we have. You know, we're going to make this work. So is Antonio Brown, my question would be, is Antonio Brown okay with, hey, today, you know what you're going to do? You're going to lift the top of coverage today, and you're going to get three targets. You ain't getting 11, and that's just the way it is. Now, here's the thing he knows going in here, because he orchestrated. I mean, he hired a PR firm to help him get out of Oakland, he okay? Yeah. So here's what he knows going in here. Bill Belichick does not suffer fools. And if you don't buy into the program, mm -hmm. you don't get to play. And you know what? We'll win with you. We'll win without you. <laughs> That's where they yeah, are right they now. Don't need you. Right? We don't need you. Mm -hmm. So he's going into a situation where you better be okay with, hey, today, you know what? You got two targets. And you got to be happy about contributing to a victory. Are you ready? Are you mature enough? Can you handle that in in kind of in this phase of your career? Mm -hmm. That's the question you have to ask yourself. Mm. And your answer is? My answer is absolutely not. I mean, I don't think I don't think like I don't think he can do that. I don't either. <laughs> I don't believe that for two seconds. Skip, okay. Skip. I don't trust AB. You know I don't trust him. Uh, as you far, haven't from the start from, from day one. Nope. From twenty sixteen. You're absolutely right because the Patriot way is selflessness. AB's way is selfishness. That just pretty much sums it Less, up. Yeah, it exactly. does. Less and niche. That's mm -hmm. that's it with AB. Mm -hmm. yeah. And like you said, Steak, the Patriots, what they do. I don't know what their offense is. It is whatever your defense isn't good at that day, that's what their offense is. It might be the receivers catching X amount of balls. It might be Sonny Michelle and Rooks Burkhead rushing for 200 yards between the two of them. Whatever you can't stop that particular day, that's what you're going to get a heavy dose of. A.B. knows, since he went on this streak, he's the first and only receiver to have six consecutive seasons in which he caught 100 passes. Mm. But in that process, he averaged... 170 targets a season. Mm -hmm. Coach Belichick, that's not going to happen. Even if they... He's not going into a game, Skip. They don't go into a game and say, you know what, Gronk? I guarantee you getting 11 targets today. Or I guarantee you, Josh Gordon, you're going to get 11 targets. That's not what they do. Because the defense might not dictate that. And they're not force-feeding anybody. Mm. I don't care if you Gronk. I don't care if you Corey Dillon. I, I don't care if you ran them. They I've don't force. No. Unless they, they're playing to your weakness with the run game mm -hmm. and they say, we're going to force feed whoever it right, is. Right, right. We're going to run it down your throat. That's Wait, because you're deficient. Right. right. That's right. right. Okay. He going to the game last year. Ben was going to throw him 12, 13 balls. Regardless, he can be double. He can be triple. He can be quadruple. Ben had to appease him by getting him the ball or at least attempting yeah. to. And every, you said a very good, interesting thing. The Patriots don't need him. Everybody else had needed him. Mm. And they let him get away with it. And the very first time, for the first time in about six years, there's an organization that says, no, A.B., you got to come to walk through. A.B., you can't miss practice. If you miss practice, mm. we're going to find you. And once they – see, he was cool with the fine, but once he realized the fine triggered a conduct detrimental to the team yep. and that guaranteed money – Went away. He's like, whoa, darn, I can't play with this. Now I got to get up out of here. But that guy to the right, Coach Belichick, with that visor and them cut off hoodies, mm -hmm. Skip, he ain't about no, he, Skip, he ain't about no bull jive. Mm -hmm. He ain't about foolishness. Mm -hmm. Now you come in there if you want to, like I said, you don't check your ego at the door. You leave your ego in the city where you came from. Because, see, if you check it at the door, you might run back when he turns his back and get it and bring it in there. Mm -hmm. Coach Belichick ain't having that. Mm -hmm. I don't believe he can. 
Now, we're going to see, but I don't believe it. Nor do I. And I picked the Patriots to win the Super Bowl, and I like their chances slightly less today than after what I saw last <laughs> night because they looked really good Did last the, night on, on both sides. Both. The only way I give this any hope is that one thing about Brady and Belichick is they're both watch this guys. Mm -hmm. Belichick has always been watch this NFL. I'll take Corey Dillon who had some baggage. Right. And I'll, I'll show you what I can do with him. And then he's right. had a long list of I'll, I'll be Al Davis East. I'll, I'll, I'll take the renegades and I'll show you in my system that they will keep their head down and, and right. nose to my grindstone and mm -hmm. they will be uh, performers for me. They, they will be contributors for me. Tom Brady has been a watch this guy just in his own right saying, look, at 42, I look like I'm going on 24 because mm -hmm. every year he says, okay, watch this. Right. So now he's turned into, to me, the best leader in sports because he's taken Josh Gordon under his wing and said, watch what I can do with Josh. Right. Josh is pretty good. Right. He's not what he used to be, but he's, boy, does he not contribute? Did he yeah. not contribute last mm -hmm. night? So those two, if anybody can pull this off, they can pull it off. But I just think Antonio is too far right. gone. And I thought it had a chance until I saw what he posted just yesterday on Instagram, which is the absolute worst sign that Belichick could get early on, which is a caricature picture, if we could see it real quickly, if you have it handy, of <laughs> A.B. sitting in a caricature. It's just he's sitting on yeah. a pile of money, and, and the caption is, the Patriot way. Uh -huh. Here we go. The Patriot way. Right. That's, that's the Patriot way because he got $10 million guaranteed, which shocked me. You know, if he had had to crawl to New England and they said, we'll give you a minimum to play for us right. and prove yourself this year, I'd say, okay, maybe you got a shot. But now he's boasting about, because he would he lose in Oakland? 30, 30 million. million. Now you got 10 exactly. million guaranteed. Right. And you're boasting about it. Business is uh, booming again. Who makes that, those, right. too? I don't I, know. Well, he's got, a, he's got a whole team. And you talked about leadership from Tom Brady. Mm -hmm. One of the things he's done for this organization is he has allowed himself to be coached. And in yeah, today's game, point. you yeah. have to he sets the tone. somebody yeah. has to allow mm -hmm. uh, if he allows himself to be coached, if he allows himself yep. to be dog cussed by the head mm -hmm. coach, guess he what? Does. Everybody has to fall in line. Here's what's interesting, because you talked about them on both sides of the ball. When I watch the Patriots play, they are the most precise. Hmm. They are the most hmm. disciplined football team in the National Football League yep. from a technique standpoint. Mm -hmm. From, you know, from a coverage standpoint, where guys are supposed to be, you hit your landmarks. If you're a hook player, yeah. you hit your landmark. You know, they, they, your back end of, or the backside of run, the shoulders square, squeezing, you know, yeah. making sure they're, they're there for the cutback, but don't get beat by the boot keep. I mean, they are the most disciplined team in football. And they have brought in one of the most undisciplined football players mm -hmm. on the planet. Yeah, mm -hmm. off, the field, off right, the field. Right, off the field, yeah. right. No, yeah. he doesn't discipline on the field. Well, yeah. you can make it. I mean, he runs discipline routes. He's a good route runner, but, yeah. He, he also throws Gatorade cool. Tom, Tom Brady not only likes to be coach, they coach him hard. Mm -hmm. What happens when you coach A.B. hard? <laughs> when you put up skill, when you put up the tape, because they say they put up the tape of Tom Brady when he makes mistakes. Mm -hmm. What happens when you put up a tape and A.B. loafing in a route? Yeah. That's a good point. Uh, How's he going to respond to it? Mm. We're going to have to wait and see how this one plays out. <laughs> I just don't know if it's going to be a long one. But, uh, Mark, thank you for your thank insight. Thank you. Always good, good, job with us. Yeah. good job yesterday with Kyler Murray's game. Yeah, good stuff. That was, he, good. that was, I'm telling you what, he's an exciting little dude, man. <laughs> We're going to have him back is. to talk Kyler another day because I feel like we could go to a lot of places there. Uh -huh. Thanks again, uh, it. Pat Mahomes, guys. He's was it? The side of your <laughs> Kenneth, that is rude. Stop it. I'm talking, we're talking Pat Mahomes. Oh, next. Bad, be bad, nice bad, to bad, this okay. guy. Is oh, he be the one to take down the Patriots? We'll go there next. <laughs> Thank you for watching. You can subscribe here to get the latest from the show and be sure to check out more of the best clips from Undisputed or go watch a few other segments from our other shows on FS1.